got pretty good. It's yeah. Island TV. This must be the Channel 31 carry on. Isn't Channel 31? Oh, too late. Yeah. Tuesdays and Saturdays. Yeah, I've been on Channel 31. And who are you here to see tonight? Uh, Magnus and um, Giddy Prime. Right, friends of yours? Or? Yeah, yeah, a couple of, couple of guys, like Alan Brown plays guitar in uh, Magnus, and Giddy Prime, uh, we've met them through gigs and that at other pubs. Right. They played here some few times. Yeah, yeah. good crowd here. I recognise you. Oh, thanks very and much. Yeah. Thank you well, very you know much. Sue Headley, right? Uh, yes, yeah, I do. Yeah, a good friend of mine. I've known her for 20 years, because I lived in Adelaide and I met her over there. One of the major producers of this show, I must admit, is... Yes. Sue Headley. Sue Headley. Yes. Well, thank you very much for thank that you. little bit of... Thank uh, you. very much. Start. <laughs> I've been, uh, studying up on my jazz chords while I've been singing at home since I was in uh, New York last year. And while I was in New York City, I thought it was really funny that uh, a skinny white boy from Mentone was so into the blues music when I had nothing to complain about, really. So this is for all you skinny white kids out there with no problems who just dig blues, all right? Can you still see me? <laughs> Yo, I'm a skinny white boy and I'm playing the blues for you here. So I love the blues, but I've never been working on a railroad track. With everything I know trapped upon my back, and I've never been in trouble with the man. But I play the blues whenever I can, yes, love. Back to Asylum TV, I'm here with Jimmy Hocking, one of the hardest working buggers around, I tell you. Welcome to Asylum TV, Jim. Thanks, nice to be here. Uh, good set, man. Yeah, thanks, it was great. Everyone went, as they say, off. Yeah. <laughs> the festival's turned out to be fantastic, Yeah, it, it has. The weather's been so great, like, um, every year, any outdoor festivals are going, please be good weather, but, like, the weather's been great. We knew it on the, the day, didn't good. we? We knew it yeah. on the day, coming down yeah. this morning. That's right, that's right. And he, he, right. as I opened up, uh, you are one of the hardest working buggers around town, don't you? I'm always working. I mean, I've, I've had a long uh, career in rock and, and folk and now the blues, and it seems to be an ongoing process. So, um, 
I, I, I just want to do it, you know? And you're doing it very well. Where, Thank you. Where to now? What, well, what, what uh, holes, uh, well, you know, down the track? I kind of, uh, I'm really into this kind of uh, blues, slight jazz thing at the moment. And, and um, yet. <laughs> yeah, and yet. <laughs> but I mean, I have other hats again now. I'm, I'm into bluegrass as well currently. I do a lot of mandolin playing at home. Oh, yeah, is that right? So I have a pet bluegrass project on the side. Uh, I will be doing, obviously, more blues things throughout the year. I've got a new album, Give Jimmy Some Love, uh, released at the festival. And I'll be going back to the States maybe uh, mid next year to do some more gigs following well, up last year. You have been travelling a bit. Yeah, I, uh, I, well, it's my first trip to the States to actually play. And I played in Manhattan uh, just over a year ago. I was there, I played the anti-folk scene, and uh, I, I sat in with a house band in Bleecker Street over a few nights. So uh, He just doesn't stop. He just doesn't <laughs> stop, you know. Who just thought, eh? <laughs> the skinny white kid. No, in New York, you know. But you're a Melbourne guy. I'm a Melbourne guy through and through. Yeah, yeah. I, I still live here. I live down the Mornington Peninsula now, but yeah. I've, I've always been a Melbourne boy. I stayed in Sydney for a spell when I was playing with the Jets, but outside of that, I really prefer to live in Melbourne than anywhere. So. Jim, it's a pleasure to watch you perform. Mate, thank you very much. And it's um, and, and it's always a pleasure to talk to you. And thanks <laughs> for coming on Asylum TV. No worries, thank and, you. And uh, well, we hope to see more of Jimmy live soon. Excellent. Okay. Yeah. Check your gig guy for details. You know. <laughs> Hi, folks. I'm with the organiser of the Queensborough Festival.